Hello everybody, Tracky here and welcome, welcome to another episode of my Let's Play series on Minecraft. Uh, playing up to 1.9 and Snapshot Day. It's Snapshot Day. That means snapshots are out. We have snapshots, but we're not in the snapshot. No. Um, yeah, you can probably see from my uh, inventory, for those who have been playing around with it, I don't have the extra little... Uh, bit there for holding my sort of uh, left hand I think it is so the bits in there so unfortunately I'm not running the snapshot and the reason being is I've, I've been playing on it a little while oh that's new getting actually hit by one of these guys in here um yeah so uh, I've been uh, I've been playing around on it all day since uh, since it was launched this afternoon um, and there is a lot of bugs there is a lot of bugs let me tell you there is a lot of bugs lots of bugs lots of bugs so i haven't uploaded it um one of the bugs that i found because obviously we're not in the end um so in theory that shouldn't matter too much but um yeah i had a problem with potions so i've kind of decided not to not to use it just yet and to give you an example we got potions in here we have so we've got two potions in here but in the snapshot they just showed up as water bottles and they weren't even coloured. They had the null sort of purple black uh, thing to them. So I know there's another snapshot out tomorrow. So that means um, a lot of those bugs will be fixed. So I, I think the progress with this, as snapshots come out, we won't necessarily leap into them for this world. I'll probably test them, make sure it's stable for what we're doing, um, and then we'll move on to them. But ah, oh, just so awesome the amount of uh, amount of stuff. So we'll probably talk about a lot about it today. Um, I'd encourage you to go and um, play on it, but don't necessarily play on your world, or at least do what I did, back up your world first. So um, now I don't know if I've shown you this as a, as a finished area really for the um, this brewing area and enchanting area and whatever down here but this is kind of finished which i think is looking kind of cool definitely doesn't look like the nether um now one of the things i wanted to do today is to get a nether portal over to our village and what i did is when i was at the village i made a note of the coordinates which were um something like minus seven six seven plus seven nine eight um i've then divided those coordinates by eight and that should give us a place in the nether where our portal should go to, to link to it. So, and that brings us out just the other side of this spawner. So there's the spawner there. And it actually puts a portal right here, which is amazing that it's right where we're already using it. I was thinking it's going to take us way off over in the other direction. But the fact is here is really cool. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place a portal here. Um, but I'm not going to go through it because to link up portals properly what you really need to do is have them built in both worlds in the same place uh, uh, at the same time so what I'm going to do is I'm going to light this portal so the portal is active and I'm going to leave it and that's why I haven't done the rest of this area yet because if there's a problem with it I want to know because if I go through there it might pull me out in a cavern underground or something like that whereas what I want is a portal directly um in the village where i want it so at the coordinates i've recorded so that's what we're going to do now is head over to that village uh but we'll stop off at the base on the way now you may remember i was finished off last uh, episode we put this map up so we are up um up where the little green areas at the top right and our village is just here so we're going to head over there because i'm hoping that somewhere in this quarter but i guess it could be anywhere over in this half is going to be um an end portal so um yeah we've got to try and work towards that but i want to put a link to the village anyway because it'll help getting villagers and all that kind of stuff so that's why we're setting up the portal today um now the other thing is where did I put those ender pearls? We had three ender pearls and they're not in there or there. So they're probably down the bottom. I've been working on this area a little bit. As you can see I've got this because one of the things I've had to do is I've I was coming down here getting stuff, going back up here working. Um so I've got to bring this down to the bottom and I think I'll bring the brewing stands and all that kind of stuff. We're going to bring it down here and we'll have one big work area. So I'm going to put the bookcases around there. We're going to have the crafting table in the middle and then it'll be nicely lit up and it means we can access it from anywhere. We've got a workstation. We've got these. I've just got to work out where to put the brewing stands. But yeah, all looking good. So have I put the ender pearls up here? I have indeed. So we need those. 
got some blaze rods um that's all i need so i think uh the other thing i will do yeah let's take a bed um because we don't have one there we're probably at the top if we uh if we need to sleep it's probably easier to have a bed so uh, let's take one of those and we probably get all the other supplies because we are going to come through and I missed that jump. We're going to come through the nether back. So we should hopefully stick the portal up and go through the nether back. So uh, now I think we did leave a boat here somewhere. So let's have a little talky while we're on our way over to the boat here. Yeah, I've had a play around in um, in the snapshots. The end looks awesome so um if you're not sure how to get snapshots on your minecraft you just got to edit your profile and you need to tell it that um you want snapshots <laughs> simple as that really um so actually i'm not even sure if we can go out this way or not but uh yeah snapshots absolutely awesome um in terms of yes we can go but we've got to go that way really haven't we so right I'm probably going to break this boat. No, let's see if we can break it this way. Sword, sword, give me. There we go. Um, yeah, the end looks awesome. Um, the Ender Dragon fight is different. Um, the way that is all set up, so I can see why they wanted to fight the uh, you to fight the dragon again. You can refight the dragon. So, um, and there's going to be a lot of new stuff happening. I think we know that because. Um, they've already tweeted that a lot of stuff is not working yet and they haven't included everything you haven't got shields yet you haven't got a lot of stuff so uh, that's going to be coming but there's also a lot of questions and stuff in the end that we kind of going yeah what's that what's that going to be used for because we don't really know so um yeah it's going to be interesting all the future snapshots and all the plans they've got they've also got long-term plan but we don't quite know what that is yet uh, so yeah, really looking forward to uh, seeing what they do with uh, a, a lot of the stuff they've got there. Um, we've got some new new blocks, obviously, a uh, new mob in the end. We've got beetroot. So uh, don't know how we grow beetroot, how we find beetroot seeds or anything like that. Do we find that in new villages? We're obviously not going to find it in this village now. Um, so where does beetroot come from? That is the, the, that, that's the only thing I want to know. I, I don't, you know, I don't care about anything else. Just where do we get beetroot? That that that's the question. Um, yeah, well, it's a question. Now, which way am I going? Are we going over here? I think we're going over here. Um, yeah, so uh, that's obviously something we need to know. Is you know, sort of where we get somebody. So we'll learn that as we're going along. I think the end of dragon fight is going to be quite tough. I think there's um, yeah. I, I I think certainly single player. Um, it's going to be an interesting fight because, well, to be honest, and there's our village. Um, yeah, they've 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 caged up some of the um, the the tops of the towers. So to break the crystals, you've got to get through iron cages. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's going to be interesting. I can't get under your boat. It's going to be interesting to see how that goes when we eventually get to the end, how the fight goes. Um, how the dragon stays more in a particular place. The towers are in a, a circle. So, um, and the end dragon kind of stays around there and it comes and sits on um, what we envisage to be the exit portal. Um, but it kind of looks like a nest. That's how they've kind of done it, is um, the dragon comes um, and sits down on its nest and uh yeah based on that it sort of um it, it makes it a bit easier to attack i guess from that sort of point of view but getting it getting the initial um get the dragon down on its health initially that that might be a bit tricky so I, i'm going to be interested to do that in um single player let's just see our coordinates now so um we did turn around and say 767 which is there and we did say 798 which is this one here so that is the center um that grass grew really really quickly didn't it uh, we've got plenty of obsidian though right so let's get this going here before in fact do we still have a bed in this one here we don't so let's put a bed in here um because it would be good to have a bed in a base and we probably ought to put a door on that um we haven't got a door uh now, do we have any other blocks other than dirt blocks? We'll use dirt blocks for now. I hate wasting. Uh, I'm gonna have to check that now. Yeah, it is three high. 
I had a feeling there I'd only done it too high for a minute. Um, and we'll put that there just for continuity. And we'll stick that there and that there. And we'll light it. And this should link to our nether portal in the nether. Let's go and find out. Dun, dun, dun. Yes. So that's linked through to there. Does it go back though or does it create another portal? This is the key. Do, do, do. We are here. Hooray! So that's linked up nicely, uh, which is pretty good. So, um, yeah, looking forward to uh, getting the stable snapshots. And as soon as we've got that, we will start working um, in that mode um, because I think, you know, that's going to be nice to do that. Now, let's get a little bit of blaze powder. Let's turn one of these into an eye of ender. Ba -bom. Let's throw our blaze powder on the ground and let's throw it in the air. Didn't go that way. It went that way. Cool. We got it. So that's good actually, unless it's outside the um, outside the actual uh, area. Um, because you're going in this direction. Let's just go a little bit further, because if you think that's towards the wall, that's towards our home over there, so we're in the right area. And there it goes again. Hopefully it doesn't break. Nope, so it's still further this way. So we'll go uh, a little bit further. And there's the wall, so hopefully it's not... No, so, oh, it's curving a little bit. I hope it's not outside the wall because that would be terrible. And we have to go and look at the other ones. Oh. Where did that go? Oh. Now, does that mean... Is it going into the ground? You know what? I think it is. There it is there, it's come up there. Right, let's just mark that spot. That'll be nice if it is. Let's just see if there's a cave down here. And can we get down to it? Or we're we just gonna dig. Of course the one thing I haven't brought with me, and it's not really much of a cave, is it? Ladders. I haven't brought any ladders. Need some ladders. Um because if we're gonna go down, we need to uh need to dig down and get back up again and we could use blocks but it's better to have ladders let's just go somewhere oh it does well, let's go exploring let's go we've got torches we've got everything else so can we get down this way looks like we can it's a bit of a drop isn't it but that's lit up down there so why is that lit up down there uh, did we bring any blocks? No, we didn't. Of course we didn't. Whoa! Why would we bring blocks? That would be silly. Who needs blocks? Right. Let's get let's get a few of these blocks. If we can. That doesn't go anywhere apart from into a ravine. So maybe there's some lava down there, and that's why we're seeing all that. At least these blocks are easy to collect. Um, right, 35 blocks. Let's go back down the other way. And hopefully, we will find a way down, slowly but surely. All right. Probably just do that, really, couldn't we? That's uh, that would have been a logical. It is lava down there, um, but that's okay. So, what I should have done is made note of those coordinates at the top, and then uh, followed that down a bit, really, shouldn't I? But uh, no matter, no matter. Right, I think what we'll do is we'll keep descending here, and it was only kind of over there, so um, yeah, I think we'll just uh, keep going down if we can, and uh, make our way down there. Maybe we'll speed it up for you guys, I don't know. Well, there was nothing there, so I think... 
what we will do is go up into the dark wonderful I think we're just going to go and get some ladders and we will then make our way down there and we're not that far from the village as you can see which means actually in the nether if that's where it really is it's probably going to be in a similar area which means we might get some problems with portals who knows right I'll be back soon well it looks like it's correct because we have just come across this lovely stone here so um, yeah this is obviously a way in um, so we have found uh, the area we want to go to but um, can we actually find so we look like we're at the top we're gonna have to have a little bit of a an adventure around here light this place up fight the mobs and all the rest of it um, and hopefully find a portal that'll be really nice um, nothing so far oh we found a secret room with a chest but it usually has not very much in there something's died recently yeah a bit of iron some apples okay uh, probably take the chest anyway put our stuff in it at the end that goes down to nothing let's have a look through here so uh, different areas and this is the only thing about these places there's a creeper there I saw you and a spider hey dude come on does that mean you can go around that way instead no you can't okay uh, there's nothing else here so I'm going to probably have to go that way um, I know you're just there, you're just there, but you're just there. Can you come through here? Can you walk through a door? I cannot remember. Here's zombies. No way down. Skelly over there. Nothing else here. Ha ha. Right, anything through there? Possibly. We'll take that then. Dungeons. And we go down more. I want to hear the silverfish is what I want to hear. Because then I know we are close. Library would be good though. This is where I need the dual wielding, isn't it? I'd to have this uh, easily, um, you know, torch one hand ready in the other those ladders out me way get some proper blocks down looks like just a cave there so the portal's a bit broken up um, so we'll remember there's an area there that's broken looks like it's going into a cave yeah trouble is we could end up like we did have one that I found with Smithy a long time ago on a server and literally the portal there was no portal in fact so that's always a possibility um it was so uh separated up by these sort of things caves and all the rest of it that um yeah there was just nowhere no portal to spawn so to speak and that's no good no um no real um also, I'm looking for chests. That's the other thing you tend to get uh, a lot of sometimes. Actual um, chests sitting around. That's where we were. So we've gone through all that area. So let's go off in a different direction, shall we? Mm, we can go down there in a minute. I'm never quite sure either how those ender pearls work, because should they come down right down on top? Of where the uh, the end portal is. Oh, it's a funny space. You know, uh, is that a spawner? No, it's just metal. Looked like a, a spawner then for a second. Oh, there's a library. That's good. Lots of books. Oh, here we go. Yay, we found the portal. So um, that's good. I'm going to get loads of those spawning. So let's just put those up there a second. 
and we've got a nice safe room here in theory so uh, apart from the doors put on wrong um, and that's a bit open so uh, that's not so safe as they would say uh, did we get a door from somewhere else no we didn't we could probably do that couldn't we if we get ourselves a door from here and we can then put that up and protect ourselves but we have essentially a end portal so that's that next conquest i'm going to get take a guess i'm going to do a run in there in a second but i'm going to take a guess and say that um if we can put this up there and can we do that is it letting me or is it because it's got the iron bars there it's not right it's not so uh, let's put that up there and there not there but there and there we've kind of made a sort of safe-ish area but not really very unsafe isn't it and i can hear those little devils spawning um we are going to have to light that up because it's going to be in the way let's go and have a look in here because i'm betting there is All right guys where are you there you are These little suckers i'm guessing oh well you die in the lava you die in the lava oh there is something here one two three four so we need uh eight yeah so we need eight ender pearls or eight eyes of ender shall we say so um let's just go in our little safe room here a minute so i can concentrate right so I think what we're going to need to do is work out an area for the portal to go over there and I'm going to just set myself up with a chest and put some things in it and, and things like that. Um, but what would be interesting to know, hey dude, let's close that. So yeah, I'm just going to see what the coordinates are, see if we can just block that off again, stop any more of those little pesky suckers getting out. So if we were to build a portal, um, I guess here's as good as anywhere really isn't it so we could probably put it in the wall that's a block that's going to get some these guys um that's not that's not okay so if we were to put a portal here um there's our coordinates i'm going to make a note of those and work out where we need to go let's see where this portal brings us out does it bring us out in the same portal it does okay so I was looking at the coordinates and in theory let's just have a look at this so we are on right that's the X so if we were to go in this direction um, we need to be on the X 96 which is this is X 97 no this is X there's 96 right so that's the x96 and we need to go to uh, 114 i think i worked it out as um i suppose to 100 so that's 95 96 97 so it's actually in this direction so uh let's see if we can and we'll probably take this out to be perfectly honest and make it into a room if we can get this working now we are on a slightly higher level um, the portal down in the uh, I was gonna call it a dungeon it's not really a dungeon is it it's a um, anyway where, where the end portal is um, yeah that's a little bit uh, it brings us out right here doesn't it and we've got so that's a hundred and eight and i need it to be 114 so interestingly enough it puts us out there slightly so uh what we probably ought to do is not do that let's go and get a fire potion just in case something spawns out there blast us off and we land in the lava i think that would be a wise choice so let's get rid of some of this valuable stuff because I haven't died yet on this that would be a first and I don't want it to happen uh, let's get rid of those in there don't need that don't need that or that um, I'm gonna take the obsidian 
but the level down there is only uh, level 33 so we what we probably ought to be doing is actually building steps downwards um, that would kind of make sense because uh, and I didn't get the potion did I the um, the distances actually matter now on height why can't I put that in my inventory so if the distances matter on height um, if I go for that portal now you see I'll go back to the village because that's that's where it's sort of scheduled to be at um, but if we start going down at this point instead um, we can start uh, so we'll go down one we'll worry about the exact details later but I'm guessing we're also going to run out we are going to run out of space um, how are we going to do this okay so let's we do one down now to there I can hear things but there is I mean in theory if we get across there we come to the right height we could do scaffolding to do it um, I'm just very nervous about being here so I'm gonna gulp this down um, and I'm gonna build out and hopefully build ourselves well, in fact what we probably do um, we can build this down a little bit that's probably not too bad we could probably step down to the right height um, at the right level if we can do it that's the question it's very precarious doing it here though isn't it um, what do you reckon do you think I'm going to die on this let's go and have a look out here actually got some fires got some whoa this is what I don't want where is he? Are you going to come up the other side? Where are you, my little friend? Are you hiding? You got to be around here somewhere because you just tried to shoot me. And the thing is, as soon as he sees me, he's gonna fire and yeah okay very precarious position let's just carry on and as soon as we see that guy we'll go for him again um, can I go any further out I think that's it for now so let's put those out there he is over there I don't have to pick my gas fights, don't I? Okay, so we are currently at 109, and I want to go out further. So we're going to carry on. And we're going to go two wide, just in case. If we can go three wide, even better. Yep. And we needed to be at 96, do we say? Um, 96.5 so we could go 97 at a push which is here right so this is where we need to go and we need to go I did say 114 didn't I yes so 114 um, that really needs to be so um, we need to go at least one more and what we'll probably do for now is just make this a very quick ghetto style area protected a little bit but not massively because um, if something spawns over there it's going to get us isn't it um, so what I need now is this and I want to be at so that's 113 there so we do need one more all in the name of trying to line portals up properly who would have believed it right so this is now going to be 114 and this is going to be 96 
that's 97 there's our portal right um, we have got enough but I'm gonna put these in and we're gonna make it a 2b3 I'm not worried at this stage about making it any bigger quite literally I'm gonna do that wrong there we go um, those on there those across there and what I then need to do is make this safe because it's far from safe and we can just use some good old cobblestone for that so if we put this here I'm glad that gas has gone away that would have made this life much much harder than it is let's just build this up at the back But um, so that should make it safe that side he says and then this should make it safe on this side as long as he doesn't see us through that gap which is always a possibility so uh, and we're gonna have to work on this area and make it really really safe safe um, and clear up all this mess because it's an awful mess let's face it we've made a right mess of this area but I'm just trying to get this going quickly as possible um, I think we're just gonna have to leave that as a run in here as fast as you can we'll close that up because that's a bit dangerous we can't really fall off we're gonna be unlucky uh, we can fall off there they shouldn't be able to blow these up so we should be alright with this kind of layout for now yeah I'm happy with that right let's just do does this bring us out in the fortress or the village the fortress does this take us back without us dying it does so that's working even though it's very close to our other portal okay that wasn't very wise was it um, yeah so even though and this is the iffy job because if we get caught round here we are definitely not very happy bunnies so let's just do that make it a little bit safer at least yeah okay it's kinda safe not really yeah so it does mean we've got two portals now we just got to check this one connects to the village and if it is happy days it does indeed excellent so we've got those two portals linked up by getting the coordinates spot on it's enabled us to get the portals linked up spot on so that is absolutely brilliant so all I've got to do now is work on this area if you like in terms of getting it looking right let's just close this up before anything does come in here and we might get a few pigments spawn in here but hey what the heck um, yeah really cool so that that's that's the next stage really done kinda of started down here we finished down here so we've probably run out of time for today but uh, hopefully you've enjoyed that episode we've had a little bit of an adventure we found the end portal we know we've got to get eight eyes vendor we've got three already which means we've got to get five more to be able to go to the end but i think we're in very good position for that so that's exciting and hopefully next time you join us we'll have the snapshots running so uh, every time the new snapshot comes out i will test it in this world and if it looks stable and it's working then we will be doing it lights on lights off lights on lights off lights on uh, yeah so really cool come and join me then and uh, we'll see what we're doing next here on the uh, wildcraft let's play single player so thanks for joining me and leave a comment down below let me know what is the most exciting bit about snap snapshot that you've enjoyed and you're looking forward to so uh, my name is wild tracker thanks for joining me and we'll see you again soon bye 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 bye